Hey y'all, welcome back to another episode of Mayo's Life, our Teen Mom series here on the channel. I am so excited to get into this with y'all because I've been gone for a long time. And I'm saying that because I noticed that it's been a long time and I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I know that I've been in my I know that I've been working and I really, really have been missing y'all so, so much. So right now we have... Amara outside smoking her sick. You already know it's her morning sick. She just woke up. The girls are upstairs resting, but we are going to make them some breakfast so that we can get them ready for our next shift at the spot that we have. So if y'all haven't watched last episode, we did do our first day at Amara's food spot. It went okay. I think it was a, you know, it was good enough, but I think that this episode, we're going to try to make it so we make a little bit more money. So yeah, as our girls up here in the front lobby, we'll go ahead and have her get some groceries. So she's done with her sick. Now she's happy and relaxed. So that's good. We're going to have her come in here so that she can grab some groceries. I don't know what we're going to make. I ain't going to lie. Probably some eggs and toast or something probably get some dairy products get some eggs get some bread and then let's just check and see if we need anything else it looks like Maya is up okay and it looks like baby girl is still napping. Oh my God, I love this blanket so much. So I wanted to show y'all this. <laughs> yes, y'all, Dollar Sims snapped. Like, she snapped. She got this blanket functional to where we can sleep with our baby in the bed. Like, and y'all, don't come for me talking about how babies shouldn't be in the bed with their moms. I don't care. I ain't gonna lie. It's the Sims, but we can't. I do anything to our baby nothing bad can happen to her so yeah we gonna make sure make it so that she sleep with us and it'll save us some space in this room because you know we used to have that crib on the bedside so yeah but anyways we came up here so that we can make sure we have all the ingredients for this breakfast so what we need is some sausage that's the last thing we need so i'm gonna have her grab that real quick all right, now that we have everything, we'll have her come on up these stairs so that she can prep all of the food. And then it looks like Mayel is hungry as well, so we can probably have her help us. Okay, so let's have her put everything out that we need. All right. Does anything need to be open? Yes. Okay, so we opened everything up. Now we can go ahead and make it. Is there an option to cook together? Yes. Okay, let's mix this with Mayel. Where is the breakfast? We can't do breakfast with her. So we can only make certain meals together, which is a little weird. We can do the avocado, cream cheese, toast, but I'm not about to do that. We'll do that on another episode. I guess we'll just cook by ourselves. We'll have her do a family size, cause yeah. And I guess since we will have to wait for her to cook, we'll just go ahead and do some tummy time with baby girl. Ooh, first girl, wash your hands. You over here cooking. Wash them hands and then you can resume it. And then let's see if we can come and wake her up. Oh Lord. Okay, we just gonna replace that, y'all. I know it was $100, but yeah, no. We ain't got time for calling no property manager to come do that. But it looks like baby girl is up, so let's go ahead and do some tummy time with her. 
Okay, let's have her pick her up. <laughs> and let's see. Because it looks like I can't find it. It should be under activities. Okay, there we go. Tummy time together. She is a little hungry, but we'll try to do a little bit of tummy time with her while we can. And, oh, she's done with the food. Okay, let's go ahead and mop this up. And then we'll go ahead and eat. Did y'all do the tummy time? Do the tummy time with your baby. We'll feed you afterwards. You'll be just fine. I promise. We just want to get a little tummy time in. But baby girl damn near hungry too. So we probably should feed her first. Let's go ahead and get her a bottle. So we got that bottle for baby girl. Let's go ahead and feed her. Mama needs comes last. And then I guess we'll have Amara come do some laundry once she's done. Yes, baby girl got to eat too. And then other than that, her knees are pretty good. Okay, so then we can go ahead and put her down while we eat. And then we'll do a little tummy time with her. We could probably have grandma do some tummy time. She'll probably done. What is you doing downstairs, girl? Not her mopping downstairs. Oh, my God. The Sims team, y'all need to fix that. <laughs> no bullshit. And where are you going? Yeah, no. <laughs> you got on your whole, like, pajamas. Amara just now getting her food too, so we might just have to go straight to the restaurant so that we're not doing that too, too late. I hate that. We never get enough time to play with our baby and get some tummy time in because we really want to get her to the stage of where she's crawling. We, we got too far in this LP to where she's not crawling yet, so yeah, I think we need to work on that. And grandma can really come and help her with that instead of Amara. Because, I mean, not Amara, instead of Mayel. Because Mayel needs to harvest her plants and all that good stuff. So we'll have her harvest that when she's done eating. And then she can put Anna in here so that she's not so far away from us. Okay. Now she craving another cigarette already. And then she put the baby on the floor. I was gonna say, I know you didn't. Okay, come finish your food, Amara. She don't seem like she too much hungrier, but we're gonna have her finish that. Amara, you can go ahead and clean up everything and then put the food in the fridge. Looks like she's doing it on the hardwood floor. Y'all don't mind, don't mind the floor. Cause we really want this baby to at least get a little tummy time in. It don't really matter where it's at at this point. Cause they like, they be, it seems like they be having a hard time doing it. So I'm assuming it's because of where we are. We just gonna let them have that. Um, no, you're not about to clean up no dishes from nowhere else. Okay, let's take care of our needs a little bit. Brush our teeth and we can change our baby. And also we can change ourselves. Go put Anna here. And then also have her brush her teeth. And then she'll go and have a cigarette before they go and leave. Nayara, not right now.
But if y'all want her to spend a little more time with her friends, y'all let me know. And we'll definitely dedicate an episode to her friends specifically. Okay, so now she's changed. We'll get the car seat and the baby. And then we need to have Amara to come downstairs so she can smoke. And I didn't forget, I had it to add 400 or $548 because in the last episode, they took our money. Like our DoorDash basically stole all our food. And speaking of, yeah, we might as well order that stuff right now. Because we going to need that for the restaurant anyway. Now what we need is bread and eggs. So that's what we're going to order. And we're going to try this again. Hopefully they bring our food. And then we also need frozen berries. Okay. So she's going to call them to drop that order off. And they should be here. We're going to be opening up a little later. But that's okay. People be out late regardless. Go ahead and pick your baby up and bring her down here. Okay, her mom out front. Delivery should be here soon. He bringing it to our door. Okay, we gonna have Amara come up here and grab it real quick. Which is good to know. I'm glad they bring it all the way up to our room. So cool. <laughs> Where he just put that shit? I was gonna say. Hey, put that in your inventory. And then let's go. We just gonna teleport straight to the boardwalk. It's looking like a slow Saturday, but that's okay. We're gonna make sure the baby here has some shelter. So we're gonna bring her in here. And then we're gonna have Amara come in here and bring the groceries in and put them in the fridge. Okay, and now we can go ahead and put everything in the fridge. The berries, probably should open the eggs. So we put the rest of the bread in there. So we should have a good amount of stuff that should take off money when they come in and order. Oh yeah. Let me go into build mode real quick and put us a podium outside. So then when they order, they won't get no glitch. Okay, so we replaced it with that. Let's see if this works better. If not, we gonna have to bring that on out here, y'all. Okay, so they aren't able to get through to here. So let's go ahead and put that out here. Okay, and then it looks like we have somebody that sat themselves. Looks like Saweetie. Hey, girl. Let's have Mayel come out here and take the order. Uh -huh. They don't have no order. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that's our first order. Period. Okay, 
And then do we have anybody else sitting out here? No, no. Okay. Can we change her outfit? Because I really don't like that chef's outfit at all. All right, now don't be cutting yourself in there. She doing a lot. All right, let's go ahead and serve them that food. It only took twenty-four dollars from us, so let's see what they got. Okay, so she got the barbecue chicken with baked beans. And she got the southern fried chicken, cornbread, and collard greens. Do we got everything for that? Amara. I mean, I guess. I guess we do. Okay. So we made $31 off of that. Let's go ahead and clean this up for the girls. And then we do want to get Mayel a new book from the library because we got some new custom books in the game. Yes, y'all. Business is really slow. You're not making too much money, so she probably should take up another gig. That's what I'm really thinking. Okay, we can probably do this one. We need two meals and a dessert. And that needs to be done by Tuesday. So we're going to make them some spaghetti and some brownies. So we're going to need some butter and the brownie mix. And then the spaghetti, ragu sauce, and the meatballs. So I'm going to order that up really quick, y'all. So it looks like we got everything. So we're gonna go ahead and open up the shit that we need to open. Okay. Okay, bet. So we're gonna have her and Maya make some spaghetti with meatballs. It looks like we got some more customers. Ooh, and we're going to need to change his outfit. Okay, so we're getting more customers now, but we really want to have them cook. So let's get them some counter space. So I threw away all of that spoiled food. They should be able to cook now. Hopefully the baby not in the way. Because they both just stalling. Let's see if she can just make it. Okay. So it doesn't look like they got enough space for both of them, but Amara is able to make some. And then we'll have Maya go out there and wait on those guests. We back like we never left. I had to take a little break, but yeah. Now everything is back in action. We about to take the order real quick. And then in the meantime, we are gonna have Amara work on the other meals. So she's taking their order. Okay, so that order is now in. We'll have, let's actually have Mayel make the meal. She probably will need the food in her inventory. 
Let's give Maya the food for the meal. Or actually, she can make the brownies. Let's have her make the brownies. Give her the eggs. And get this back to her. Okay. So, as Maya makes the brownies, we'll have Amara finish that meal for the guest that just showed up. Dad. Cook orders. And then, as y'all see, she finished one dish for the gig that we got. So, we're gonna do another serving of some spaghetti in to finish it. Hopefully it'll still count because she not the one making it. I don't know. We're going to have her stop right there and let we're going to let her finish the dish. And then we'll, yeah, we'll serve up the dish when she's done. Okay, Maya, go ahead and serve that meal. And then we'll have Amara get that brownie out the oven. Okay, what did they get? We made $78 from that. They got some cheesesteak and southern fried chicken with collard greens. Let me just make sure we got our collard greens in here. Yes, yes. Okay, girl, don't put their food on the floor. Crazy. Okay, let's have her pack these up real quick. Come over here and pack this one up. And then she just has to make one more dish, I'm pretty sure, which is the spaghetti again. And let's check and see if we got any other orders out here. Nobody else waiting. Okay. Okay, so our rating just increased to three, three stars, y'all. Yes, I love that. Period. Look at Dom coming in with Miss Monica. If y'all know, y'all know from my first live stream ever, we made Monica, y'all. Look at her. <laughs> like, yes, she eats. She... <laughs> Don't play with her. Don't play with her. Where they finna sit at? Oh, they finna, oh, you finna go shopping? Okay. Okay, go ahead. I like, I like. Did you finish the food, Amara? Okay, she did. There we go, right there. Okay, go ahead and pack this up. Okay, everything is packed up. So now what is left is chatting with the client and delivering the food. So once these customers finish their water i think that's when we gonna go ahead and close up because it is pretty late now so go ahead and finish our waters um let's disallow new clients i said clients new customers and we need to figure out how we can stop these sims from from doing push-ups like that shit is so like unrealistic she in the whole dress okay so they're done go ahead and clean this up Mayel. and then we'll go ahead and close up so in total we made a 75 dollar profit which is not a lot but she is about to make some more money doing this gig so 75 added by two is 37.50 so we just gonna give her 37 dollars for the day Let's take that out. And like y'all seen in the last episode, we got a debit card for my L. So I'm pretty sure we can transfer the money to the debit card from the household funds. Yes. $37. Even though that wasn't a lot. I mean, she got to get what she can get. We're going to go ahead and do her floral arrangements in the morning time. Like maybe when she get up 
take care of their needs a little bit when they get home <laughs> and then we'll go out and sell some more of her floral arrangements because yeah girl she is annoyed like she she i can tell that she does not like being around her mama y'all yeah y'all said in the comments she shouldn't do her mama like that y'all right she just fed up i just i can i can understand why she's feeling how she's feeling but like y'all said it don't give her the right to be treating her mama like that so yeah we're gonna make sure that maya straighten it up and try to do her part you know i'm about to have them go ahead and head home i'll see y'all when we get to the hotel okay, so we're back at the hotel i'm about to go ahead and add on that money that i had ended up deleting of ours up in the last episode y'all said get that girl her money so i'm gonna give her her money okay i'm pretty sure i had deleted like two of her floral arrangements last episode which i was so upset about and i'm like i don't want to cheat but at the same time it was a mistake on <laughs> the creator's behalf so it's like why should my yell suffer for that so since y'all said give her her money i'm about to go ahead and give her her money it's 42 dollars times two so that's 84 dollars that we're gonna have to give her we're gonna make sure we add it from the invisible money added 84 dollars and then we're going to go ahead and have her transfer that to her bank account. So that she can have all her coins. Because I feel like she deserves it. She would have ended up selling them eventually. So yeah. So now she got $798. And she's done getting the bottle for her baby girl. So we're about to have her feed her real quick. And then we're going to have Amara come and chat with that client so that she can deliver that meal. Because, yeah, we got that order ready right here. She feeding the baby. Look at her. So beautiful. I love it. I love it. Oh, Baby okay. girl got to eat too. She went through that hard work oh, day with them. Oh, yes, we're going to take care of her needs a little bit. Looks like she's getting sleepy. <laughs> it is late, so we're going to make sure that she gets some rest. Um, I think we're going to have her put baby girl down on the bed. Uh-oh, wrong person. Clean back. And then we're going to go ahead and take care of Mayo's knees. Put baby girl down. Uh huh. Yes. We'll have her use the bathroom. And then uh, Amara leaving her clothes everywhere. Golly. Okay. She's still chatting with the client, but once she's done, we're going to have her go ahead and drop off that food so that she can go and make that coin. Okay, go ahead and brush your teeth. She needs to eat though, so I mean, that was really pointless. We're gonna have her get some leftovers. Probably, yes. Some eggs and toast from yesterday. And then until she gets really tired, we're gonna go ahead and work on some arrangements. We probably should be sleeping while our baby's sleeping, but we'll let our mama handle her while we <laughs> doing our, you know, sales outside. Stop playing with her. I love the realism in this game, y'all. Like, look at that. Like, I want some of that. I'm not gonna lie. That look good. We're gonna have her put in her AirPods. 
Okay, now that she's done, she gonna clean that up. And then we're gonna start working on our arrangements. She got $750 for that. Damn, how much was that bonus? Wasn't that like a $600? Damn, that was a $600, what you call it? We might have to stick beside Amara a little while longer. So she gonna be helping us out. I ain't gonna lie, we damn near need to pay them bills though. Speaking of, let's see. Is there any bills? Sort your junk mail. No mail has been delivered recently. Show bills information. Okay. Rent ain't due yet. Okay, period. I just wanted to make sure. Because, you know, sometimes we be behind. But that's all good then. So let's go ahead and have her come upstairs so she can get some rest. Probably get some leftovers as well. And then have her go to sleep when she's done come on in here Mayel. we have some arrangements so we can make some hollies okay zero dollars Okay, so she putting that together. Got her headphones in, like, as she should. And we're going to have that volume on high. She want to tune out everything. Even though her baby right there, but I'm pretty sure she got. Yep, she's sleeping. Y'all get this mod if y'all haven't. Because, like, this adds so much realism to a game. Like, why didn't they add this to the game? I know some people be like, oh, like, you know, some people be overly sensitive of certain stuff, but it's a game. Our baby should sleep next to us, especially when we in a limited space like this. Like, we don't got space for no crib. Let's go ahead and put this in the dirty clothes. Amara, you done eating? Okay, she, she over it. She like, I'm trying to go to sleep. And again, dropping your clothes right in the middle of the floor is not where it needs to be. Now, I don't remember how much I was saying that I was going to put inside the piggy bank, y'all, for baby, um, for baby Anna. So y'all let me know down in the comments what y'all think we should do. How much we should be putting in there every time we get paid or, you know, should we go half and half? So that she can have some funds when she becomes a teenager and an adult going to college. Mayo can now make arrangements like begonias, dahlias, and tulips. I love that. She's on level three of the floral arrangement skill. And this is normal, period. Let's have her take a picture. Not of your mom. Baby girl right here. We can take a picture of her. <laughs> yes. Put a filter on there somewhere. Yeah. That look better. So that we can have the memory of us doing this. And we can put this in our inventory. And it's a it's twenty one dollars if we sold it right now. So maybe I added too much money. It would have been instead of forty two dollars because I I must have got forty two dollars from twenty one and twenty one when I was talking about it in the last episode. So okay. So we're going to have to subtract $42. I'm sorry. My yo, we ain't, you know, we got to be fair. So let's go ahead and transfer from to, and we're going to take out $42.
Okay. And then 1356. 1314. Set it. Okay. Now everything should be good. We're going to go ahead and make one more arrangement if we can. Okay, so we need two more hollies to do that, which we don't got. So we just gonna have to sell what, what you know, settle what we got, and we can sell one of them. Let's see if we got any people in the lobby right now, because if we do, we'll just go ahead and try to sell some real quick. It's some people up in here. Let's come downstairs, Mayo, while your baby's sleeping. You will have the time. When we got some clean laundry. Oh no, this this dirty laundry is a used. Oh, she got a electronic upgrade part. Sell that at 120. Uh-huh. Add that to your account. One twenty, you just like that. I love it. Okay. Now let's put her table down. And then view the inventory so that we can put our flowers in there. And then we can stock the table. Yes. And then start a yard sale so that we can sell this really quick before she gets too sleepy. Okay, we got some people coming in. You want some flowers? Oh, she ain't she ain't even look. Golly, cool. Yeah, it's looking kind of dry in here this morning. She going right up to her room. She ain't even stunning us. Says she's showing symptom of high blood pressure. We do not got time for that right now. I ain't gonna lie, that private practice mod is a little. Mm, look like everybody left you, Mayo. The bartender's coming in, but yeah, I don't know. Is he finna take a look? Okay, let's go ahead and talk to him. Give him a sales pitch. Oh, Janice in here, give her a sales pitch. You know she she love her some flowers. She gonna want her some fresh flowers in the house. Make it look like something. Oh, okay. Well, then what you come in here for? Because you know you ain't getting no hotel unless your man up in here. See, now, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't played on camera with this family since, like, last year. This is one of my first LPs on the channel. Love me, Gail. This is his mother. I stopped it because it was a lot of stuff that I had to, like, change. It's a lot. Oh, somebody sold it. I mean, somebody bought it. $21, period. Okay, we gonna transfer our monies. Let's do that. Twenty-one. Okay, and then you can put your table back in your inventory. Thanks everybody for coming. And now you can go upstairs and go to sleep, Mayo. Oh, your baby's awake. Let's check on her. She has to use the bathroom. Okay. Where did that seventy dollars just come from? I don't even know, but we just got seventy dollars from somewhere. Okay, we gonna sleep next to our baby until she poops or whatever she needs to do. Let her get a little rest. But yeah, baby girl is up. She's fine though. She has to use the bathroom soon, but I'm, I like to let the babies use it naturally. Like, sometimes it be taking them a long time, but I prefer that over anything because, like, you know, it gives us an option to guess if something was wrong with them. If they crying, like, if they crying because they got to use a used diaper or if they crying because they need the nipple or they crying, you know, because they a little sleepy. Like, you know, it's always going to be on based off of 
what happens naturally like yeah sometimes i don't even like checking the knees i want to like you know just take care of her naturally and just see you know how well i would be doing without even checking but yes, I want to do tummy time with our baby girl in the next episode for sure. And then we also are going to try to possibly grow some more plants. Depending on how well the hollies do, we might get another flower. Um, and we also do need to go to the library to get her a new book. So that's what we're going to be having planned for the next episode. I see in the comments y'all said Gavin is giving... A little crazy like she a little obsessed like he always popping up out of nowhere and i peeped that too and i ain't gonna lie i didn't peep it until y'all said something because i'm like i'm just thinking like you know he just missed her he in love with her but no it's giving obsessed so we might have to you know have my slow down with him a little bit possibly seek her interests out with other people other men other women possibly because her best friend been seeming like she was a little interested in her so you never know Mayel might be bisexual but we'll see i hope y'all enjoying in this series let me know down in the comments down below what y'all think and if y'all got any suggestions if you like this video please like this video and i will see y'all in the next one okay bye